What's going on guys? David here. I hope everybody's having a, a blessed day um, and thank you for spending your time with me today. Now, today I'm going to talk to you about starting a YouTube channel and the truth when it, when it comes to starting a YouTube channel. There are some challenges to starting a YouTube channel. You see these guys, Roman Atwood, for me, one of my biggest guys, Street Speed 717, um, and, and some of the other YouTubers I watch, you know, um, you know, Off the Ranch, Demolition Ranch, things like that. You see these guys, and, and, and you see, wow, they got all this going on, and, and um, you know, all these subscribers, and they make it look so easy. But guys, it, it doesn't happen overnight. I've been doing this for a couple months now, and I only have 18 subscribers. Um, you know, my average viewing <clears throat> is only about 20 or so per video. There's a couple out there that have done fairly well or better than others, but it's not as easy as these guys make it out to be. But I will say this, don't let that necessarily deter you. Just know that there's some challenges to starting a YouTube channel. Okay? One of the challenges is being in front of a camera. It may sound easy, but when you're in front of a camera, you know, you're, uh, you're in out there you put yourself out there okay that can sometimes be a little overwhelming for some people um, especially out in public you have a camera in your hand you're recording things people are looking at you but you get comfortable with that over time I'm still working on that myself um, one of the other things when it comes to YouTube is editing now when you first start off and if you've never edited before that can be a challenge but I will say just take your time play with your editing software um, you can go get free editing software play with that and uh, you know start making content and put out content and the more and more you do it the easier and easier it is the other big challenge for me is and if and if you you know notice here I do a lot of videos in my car this is this is me on my way home okay I work a lot sometimes 60 hours a week and YouTube it does take up some time um it can take me an hour, two hours to edit a video. And when you work 60 hours a week, making a video and editing it takes some of your time. So keep that in mind. The other thing I want to say about YouTube is again you see these big guys and you see the life that they live and the money that they make and you're like man I'd like to get on that too and go for it. it you know you might be the next big sensation but understand that it took them time to get there and not everybody's just lucky to hit these videos or, or, or to hit the subscribers that they have. Um, over time, I'm pretty sure you can do it if you put out good content, things like that. But, you know, if you really put your heart into it, you know, sky's the limits. Don't, don't let that deter you. But know that it takes time. 18 subscribers, people. We've been doing this for a couple months and I only have 18 subscribers. I'm okay with that. I like doing this. This is something that I enjoy doing. And if you don't enjoy doing it, find something else to do, please. Because, you know, you're going to go, yeah, I'm going to start a YouTube channel. You're going to get into it. Yeah, all right, YouTube. 
couple weeks in, maybe a month in, you, you, you lose it. It happens. Find what you're passionate at, okay? What's your passion? What do you like to do? Whether it's, you know, for me it's cars. For some other people it might be mechanics or it might be, uh, you know, just vlogging their daily life or shoot, you know, woodworking, whatever. Make videos of what you like to do and be genuine. That's important. If you try to put on an act, people are going to see right through that. They really are. Um, what you see is what you get from me. Okay? I'm not putting down an act. This is, this is who I am. You know, so the other, you know, keep that in mind. One of the other challenges is it will sometimes cost money to get content. What I mean by that is, okay, you don't have to go out and spend six, seven hundred dollars on the camera right off the bat. Matter of fact, I'm just using a simple GoPro. This is this is what I got for now. Um, but if you just have a smartphone, you're good. You can start making videos. But for me, like example, in the car world, you know, yes, I would love to do more install videos, more upgraded videos, more this, more that. But it, it takes money to do that. If you, you know, if you got a family to support like I do, or you pay for a house and stuff, that may not be a total option. So do the best you can what you got so the bottom line here that I'm trying to say here is this if you want to start a YouTube channel have at it you know I recommend it I've had a lot of fun I don't regret any minute of it and I would love to do more this, I really like doing this uh, but understand again you're not going to blow up in one day it takes time just put the time in put the work in and it'll start you know hopefully paying off and if it doesn't at least you have fun you know I'm having fun even if this even if I don't even get to a thousand subscribers I'm still going to do this. I like that. I have fun. And that's what it's about. If you're doing this for the money, you're wrong. You're wrong, people. You're wrong if you're doing this for the money. That's not why you should be doing YouTube. But eventually, if you go get up big enough, and this is something that makes money for you, then, uh, you know, then you're doing your dream. And, and, and you know, more power to you. Then... Yeah, it becomes a money thing, and that's a whole different story. I'm not talking about that story. So anyway, guys, the hard truth of YouTube is simple. Do it because it's, it's, it's fun, it's your passion, it's what you want to do. And understand it takes time, it takes effort. 